superstars look geared up and ready to go. The fans have been demanding this one-on-one -on -one contest, and here it is. This is it, the moment we've been waiting for. The time for talking is behind us. Now these two superstars will test one another's abilities and will like never before. This is about being the best. Well, that'll be a lot of attitude then because look at the size of those ears. <laughs> the time for talk is over and done with. Let's give the people what they came for. Both these superstars are primed and ready to roll. And no matter what, these are the types of nights they'll write about in the WWE annals for years to come. <laughs> He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Huh. So give us the breakdown here for Triple H. Michael, this might be the best shape I've ever seen Triple H in, and that's saying something. All those late-night training sessions are clearly paying off. I'm not sure what's worse when you go against the game. You try to rile him up and get him mad, or... You want to keep him calm and collected and let the cerebral assassin do what he does better than anybody else. Well, there's really no right way to go up against Triple H. You just have to do it and pray you can walk out of the ring afterward. I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. A move like that is completely unnecessary. Unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. I agree, Cole. I mean, this is intentional humiliation. an opponent. <laughs> Nearly driven through the mat. Back into the ring now. Two. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. of his name invokes visions of history. His greatest moment in WWE lore might just be at the end of an era match where he, along with The Undertaker and Shawn Michaels, are standing together, arm in arm, looking out at the crowd of more than 78,000. I get chills just thinking about it. Man, I do too. And you know, Michael, when you think about it, all the great moments, all the history this man has made, all of them that I've called as a broadcaster, I don't know if anything will top when Triple H returned to WWE 
after suffering what we thought was a career-ending torn quadriceps injury. What an ovation. January 7th, 2002 in New York City. That was a historic night. When you look at Triple H's career as a whole, he is WWE history. When I think of all his conquests, I can't help but think of WrestleMania 25. Call me old-fashioned, but the man was forced to defend his family and the WWE title. He did both, and that's beyond admirable. Well, that's the first time we've seen that move tonight from either locker room. I gotta love it. Nice. They roll out of 
the ring, hoping to recover here. Yeah, if they didn't get out of the ring, it would be over right now. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. He's too busy bragging and posting the battle in this matchup. This can turn real ugly, real fast. Oh my, look at this! Well, that's it! The finisher again! Wow! That oh, you do not get up from that. This foe's in a world of hurt now for the pin and the win! One. with an impressive victory. And you know there are guys in the back right now hoping they never have to cross paths with this guy. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. Appetizers are over. Time for the main course. Singles match on tap next. Action! Oh, five. It's in the Laredo. They gotta get there today, though. Ain't no time for trying to lay low, babe, bro. If you can't do it, all you gotta do. As you can tell by the sound of the crowd around me, we've got one of the best lineups in WWE history, so stay tuned. I look at this card and my mouth starts to water. Sit tight for singles action. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. I'm looking forward to it. We have one of our breakout talents versus Triple H. Man, social media is already buzzing. Just imagine what will happen when the match starts. Ladies and gentlemen, that we have in store for you tonight. 
I'm Michael Cole, alongside the Hall of Famer, Jerry the King Waller. And you know, Michael, I've been looking forward to this night for a very long time. Let's get it on. This is absolutely fantastic. Someone really should check out. I mean, a maneuver like that takes your career and it just flashes it before your very eyes. Yeah, that wouldn't be a very long flash for you, Cole, but this guy's in trouble. Oh, look out. We're taking this thing to the floor. Yeah, and it's real dangerous out here. King, what, in your opinion, can an opponent do or try to do to get the best of the game, Triple H? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. That's a good sign. Hey, guys, are these two going to dance around the ring all night, or are they going to actually attack each other? Jeez, come on, let's go. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. What offense Triple H is showing at this point? Four. First time for everything, I guess. Let me tell you, when it comes to finishing moves, I don't think anyone has perfected their finisher like Triple H has the pedigree. He can and has flattened opponents of all shapes and sizes with that move. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. He didn't need a GPS to find the mark. This guy's a machine. When it comes to the pedigree, King, you're absolutely right. Triple H is down to all comers. Something that's also important to remember is these pedigree people on chairs. Yes. The Spanish announce table, oh. our announce table, oh. on thumbtacks. The game doesn't discriminate on how he batters an opponent. And you know, when talking about the pedigree, it's such a brutal move. I mean, so hard for an opponent to anticipate that it adds another level of danger to Triple H's attack. Most of the time, an opponent won't know what happened until it's too late. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. This guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. There's a sick power bomb. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. not looking like himself here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. But it's important to know that this match has been so evenly contested so far. You really can't pick a winner. It's a good point, John. And I'd say this match is about as even as it can get at this point. Breaker. Good night. Oh, that'll take the wind right out of you. Fasten your seatbelt. Here we go. Look at this. Out. There's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left after that. Oh, good grief. Now that is just dangerous. No kidding. One, two. Oh, just try hands into the throat. He's showing no signs of letting up. And it's Triple H getting out of that one. He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup.
He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. In trouble now. It may be just a... With this kind of attack, you have to wonder just how much longer they can compete in this match. Yeah, I completely agree. The way things are going in there, I'd say not much longer. My gosh, this is a beating. Triple H. What a move. There it is. The finisher. This could all be over right now. We got a couple. Serious injuries. Okay, no this could do it. Maybe he is. Two. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. Of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. Nice reversal. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Quite like this guy. With authority, laying a small on the back. He thinks he has it. Nobody home there. Nobody home. Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. Strikes being delivered here by Triple H.
the same after that backbreaker. Can he score the pin? Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. Will it be? This one. There's nothing more pure than picking up a win in a good old-fashioned one-on-one fight. What a great match we just saw here on Raw. Thank you to everybody at home for choosing to spend part of your Monday night with us. The next match has all the makings of a great one. Singles match on tap next. We have one of the best talents on the roster today in a match that is sure to not disappoint.
Mobile, Iowa, from the heart of the South, in Mobile, Alabama. Come back, because this is going to be a night talked about for years to come. Looking at this car, and I just got to rub my hands together and smile. Sit tight for singles action coming up next. Don't change the channel. We have singles action coming up. No one's going to change any channel. We have one of our breakout talents versus The Miz. This could blow the roof off this place. Thank you for joining us tonight, folks. We have an amazing night ahead of us. Yeah, and we're just moments away from tonight's opening match. I can't wait. This one's going to be great. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. Look out. He's got his sights set on that neck region. King, what must Miz be thinking about as we get started? It goes without saying that the Miz is incredibly impressed by his performance here tonight. But me, I'm going to see a little bit more of this match before making any judgments. You may not like Miz, and quite frankly, I don't. You're not alone. But you've got to give the devil his due. He's good, but he knows it. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. I'm not concerned. I don't think I've ever seen him look more motivated than he looked heading into this match. Oh, man. I'm certain he came into this match knowing it would not be a cakewalk. Caught by surprise by a brutal shove. Michael, that's the one thing I used to hate when I was wrestling. Get shoved. Yeah. <sighs> 
Tennessee, so I get your reference. You still use them. Yeah, but I don't go there too many times. Nicely done. And he gets out of the way. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. A little weary here. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. You said it, and he does not want to let his opponent gain some steam here and start to get the upper hand. Yeah, but at some point, one of these guys is going to pull ahead, and that might just be what we're looking at here. This might not end well. Jeez, after that one, he definitely has to muster up a comeback. Oh, the reversal by the Miz. He's not looking like himself here, but he's very aware. 